What's up, everybody? How's it going? My name is Tyson, and today we are diving inside of ClickFunnels 2.0 to tackle how to adjust and customize your course enrollment emails. Course enrollment emails are a great way to basically give everybody a warm welcome as they or before they even enter the course area, right? It's going to help as far as personalizing the experience and making sure that everything is branded correctly for your business. Now, with that said, let's go ahead and dive into the platform, and I'll show you how to set everything up. Alrighty, we're starting off on my dashboard here inside of ClickFunnels 2.0. Now, from here, what we want to do is click on settings on the bottom left-hand side of the screen. Click on that directly, and it's going to load our account settings. Now, from here, go ahead and hover down until you see system emails. Click on it directly, and it'll take you to this page right here. Uh, by default, it takes us to our affiliate system emails, but uh, we're heading to courses. So click on courses directly, and you'll see there's more options than just the one we're talking about today. But today we're talking about course enrollment notifications specifically. The rest of them are still great, and I highly recommend diving in and customizing those as well. But again, we're just addressing how to uh, customize your course enrollment notifications. So in this case, click on the name directly or the little pencil icon. Either way, it's going to take you to the same location. Go ahead and click on customize here in the center of the screen. And from there, it's going to take us directly into the email editor. This is where we can actually go in and adjust and customize everything for our brand. Now, in this case, the only thing I'm really going to do here is just change out the image. So we click on the image directly on here from the ClickFunnels default image to my own brand. We'll click on that directly and we'll go probably scale it down it's a bit too large this moment in time. There we go. Awesome. Okay. Now, again, you can go in and customize this to your heart's content. There's a bunch of different things you can do as far as adding things to the email, such as more images, videos, icons, GIFs, whatever it is that you're looking for, you can definitely add it here. But in this case, I'm not going to get too crazy. The only thing I wouldn't necessarily adjust or update is going to be the the uh, sorry, the button itself. Aside from the text, the actual text here, so maybe like view course now. And if you just double click on there, it will open it up so you can just start typing like this. Now... Uh, but aside from that, I probably wouldn't adjust the link type. I would leave that as is. The reason is, is that that's a dynamic link right there. And it's going to pull the access needed for every person individually when it comes to course enrollment. So whenever they actually see this email, they click on this button right here. It's going to take them to the course area or the membership area inside of the actual uh, side of ClickFunnels 2.0. Uh, but anyways, that link right there is going to guarantee that they can get in no problem. Okay, just so you know, but everything else, have a ball, go crazy, adjust it to your liking. Okay, uh, you can also, one thing to mention here is I like to also add merge tags. So we'll say, look over here and click on merge tags, and I'll do first name, first name. So I don't know, Roy, you're enrolled, <laughs> whoever you're talking to, right? It's going to load dynamically based off of who you're talking to or whoever it is being sent to. And that's it. That's all there is to it. Now, after that, we'll go ahead and just click on publish and exit. And it's going to take us right back to that same page we were just on initially, which is going to be the overview page. There are two things we want to do from here. First thing is going to be to make sure this is active, just like this. Just toggle it on. Once it's blue, you are good to go. And then from there, just click on save. And then you are all set to go. Now, one thing we didn't necessarily touch on, I, I briefly touched on earlier, but the subject line here this is where you adjust the actual subject line is going to be attached or sent out with this email. Um, you can customize it. If you want to add merge tags, you can click on merge tags and it will show a little drop down here uh, just to personalize these emails. That's pretty much what it is. So if you want to also include someone's name here in the subject line itself, you can go over here and just say contact first name or whatever it is that you're trying to add. But anyways, hopefully this helps. If you have any questions on anything I've mentioned, please feel free to leave that in the comments below or uh, just feel free to give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more of this content in the future. If you need any help at all with anything funnel related or courses, feel free to reach out to us. We are more than happy to help anywhere we can. But for now, thanks for watching, guys, and I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day.